line out. Pull. Pull, pull. Yeah. Let's go. Shaggy and Huzo do not have necklines on. Sometimes they run close together and sometimes they run farther apart. They avoid puddles. Shaggy strikes me as a happy-go-lucky fellow. Huso is more of a serious guy. Shaggy is a labradoodle. He's got a short back, and he tends to run while Huso, the shepherd mix, trots. Huso's long back allows him to trot efficiently and quickly. Okay, just trot. 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 Good dogs. Good trot. Good. Trot, trot. Shaggy, trot. We had three inches of rain last night. This kind of open dirt road with woods all around it is where the dogs really like to open up. When the dogs run fast, their feet kick mud up into the, my face and into my camera lens. I should wear goggles. It takes a lot of self-discipline on my part not to keep the brakes on. This speed frightens me. You can see I don't really steer them. They steer themselves. The dogs have calmed down a bit after that run. Good. 
The trail ends at the freeway. The neckline is long enough so they have room between them, but short enough so that they don't step on it and trip. See how they are getting used to it. On a narrow trail like this, it doesn't make much difference. They naturally run close together. I think I prefer running them without necklines, but when they race, race rules require necklines, so they need to be good at doing it both ways. Gee. On the way home, the dogs are less energetic. In fact, I even walk some of the way. dogs. Uh -huh. Go on, go on, go on. No, no. No, leave it. Predators are not tired when they see prey. 